So uh, we are live now. Uh, okay, welcome everybody. Uh, inshallah, Rabbi Amin, we are going to start our session today uh, with Dr. Novia. Um, how are you, doctor? Alhamdulillah, <laughs> Alhamdulillah. Uh, sorry, Alhamdulillah. okay. Uh, Muhammad, uh, can you hear my voice clearly? Yes. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Okay, uh, doctor, the, the platform is yours. Um, just introduce yourself and uh, go on. Okay. Uh, first, I would like uh, I share my screen first. Okay, this is my presentation. Okay, uh, you can see that's my presentation. Yes, it's clear. Okay, thank you. Uh, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Uh, well, everyone, good afternoon for everyone in Cairo. And because in Indonesia is evening, so good evening too for you all in Indonesia. Uh, well, very nice to meet you today. Firstly, I would like to say thank you very much for uh, Mr. Muhammad and also Mr. Muhammad and also all of my team uh, that we can collaborate together so we can contribute about something for real law English community help. Uh, well, in my time today, uh, before I going to show you about how make your own digital board with a gen board, let me introduce myself first. Uh, my name is Mafia Suryani. I love chemistry so much. Uh, that's why now I am to be a chemistry lecturer at State Islamic Mataram University. Okay. Uh, today, before we talk about a gem board, maybe you never know about Jamboard. Uh, I will give uh, you uh, about Jamboard. Jamboard is a digital whiteboard uh, that we can say is an interactive digital board. So we can integrate uh, this gem or our digital board with our Google Classroom. So if you ask me again, why whiteboard digital or why Jamboard? Uh, so right now, uh, as a teacher, we know that all of teachers in uh, around of the world uh, have the same problem uh, like me because we are trying to adapt um, like a distant learning to keep teaching uh, for our students in home. Uh, but sometimes uh, we confuse and we uh, I do not know because there are many platform education that actually can help us for teaching. Uh, for example, because I teach about a chemistry, sometimes I help to draw a chemistry structure. So I need another things to deliver to my student. That's not enough if I just um, deliver my presentation or I explain about my uh, subject, it's only by PowerPoint. So that's why uh, I say just uh, you of off about the gym board. Uh, in another search, uh, I, um, uh, you can see uh, from my presentation now, uh, whiteboard uh, can space for free from talks and notes and also all of our student ideas and also allow for documenting learning in heavens and also multiple contributors. Uh, it's meant that when our students can access uh, the gym board, they also have a many markers so they can uh, contribute and collaborate with us another that everyone is on the same pages uh, so why jamboard uh, actually it's um, jamboard over okay this uh, jamboard over unique capabilities to enable the skills to for example problem solving critical thinking teamwork literacy and also can build and improve our creativity and also communication Okay, before I continue my presence, uh, I will 
uh, all of you watch this uh, video about Jambo. This is Jambo. It's like a whiteboard. Okay. 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 Okay, uh, go back to my presentation again. Uh, uh, well, guys, after you watch this uh, video, how do you think about Jamboard? Uh, maybe for the first time, uh, you just think that a uh, Jamboard is only this device. And maybe uh, you will think that today I will say you about Jamboard device. But for your information, because uh, when I know for first time about Jambo device, this is a very pricely. Uh, it is about a 5,000 US dollar. So if we convert to a rupiah, it's about 70 juta rupiah, or maybe we convert to real, it's about 19,000 real. So I think we have a same opinion that a very expensive device. So uh, today uh, I will uh, show you about the Jamboard application that we also can uh, access Jamboard, the digital and collaborative and also whiteboard virtual. Okay, Google uh, also give us another way to access Google Jamboard. There are three ways that we can choose that switchable uh, for what you need or what you want. Uh, first, you can access Google Jamboard from tablet or maybe from your mobile device. So if you are an uh, Android user, you can download the application from Google Play. It is Free. And also, if you are iOS user, don't worry, you can download this application from App Store. And uh, the last way we can access Google Jamboard is from web. So we can type uh, jamboard.google.com so we can access this is one. Okay, this is the Jamboard icon. Well, let's make your own Jamboard. Okay. After this, uh, maybe you can uh, try Jamboard from your browser or maybe you can download first so we can uh, do this tutorial together. Okay, first you have to open a new tab from your Google browser, but uh, make sure you have a login with your Gmail and then Okay, this is uh, this me. Okay, uh, you can type jamboard.google.com uh, here on your search Google, and also you can access Jamboard icon on Google Apps. Okay, this is Jamboard icon. But if you first time use a Jamboard, maybe you have to scroll down because Jamboard is on the bottom. Okay, only in one click you can open this Jamboard. Okay, what a minute. Okay, this is the home page when you first time open uh, that Jamboard icon. So how to create our uh, jam? 
actually is a very very easy uh, you can click this uh, on the right button there is a little plus icon it's mean a new gem you can click okay wait wait a minute now okay after you click that plus icon this is your white Board. This is your Jamboard. So after this, we can explore about these pages and also we can explore about the tools that Jamboard give for us so we can explore more and we can uh, make a creativity uh, to explain about our subject to our student. So first time, let we rename Okay, we rename this uh, gem with our new project. Um, for example, maybe a chemistry or for other. It's uh, depend on you. Okay, this is uh, the name for our new project today. So if you uh, want to change a background because this is our gem is a white page like this, you can change the background. Uh, there are six choice we, we can click dots if you want a dots background or lines or grid so for the grid page it totally is suitable if you are a mathematic teacher and also is a gray grid and also blue or maybe black uh, black uh, black gym uh, but uh, for, for me I usually use this one because I love a dot page. So I always uh, make uh, my gem with this big one. So next, we will explore uh, these tools that a gem will give for us. Uh, first, this is pen. When you click here, there are four kinds of pen that we can choose. Uh, that depends on what you need. Uh, this is ordinary pen, this is a marker, highlighter, and also brush. There are six color uh, that's uh, up to you what you want. Uh, I can draw this one. Uh, I usually use highlighter because it's more bold than other uh, pen. I choose a uh, red color. So for your information, I don't have a stylus pen, right? Uh, I just use my trackpad mouse in my laptop. And sometimes I use my finger because my laptop is touchscreen, so I touch my laptop. But if you don't have a touchscreen or stylus pen, it's okay, guys, because we can use this track mouse trackpad mouse i mean okay i can draw like this or i can uh, write my name for example novia okay so uh, actually you can more practice about uh, how to draw how to uh, write because we don't have a stylus pen but if you think is wow it's kind of hard uh, don't worry guys because uh, we have never done to explore it uh, i mean we can more practice so we can do more so we can uh, make perfect in this our gym and other tools is erase. When we uh, need to erase uh, another thing for this, we can click and we can erase uh, wrong things or wrong text that we have to erase. Okay. And another tools uh, actually is taking up is one of the famous tools in general. Why I say like that? Because when you click sticking up, uh, you can have uh, about six uh, color did it uh, you you can decide uh, yellow green blue uh, pink orange and also uh, clearly sticky note with sticky note actually you can post it a uh, important thing that you uh, you want to deliver to your student or maybe instruction for your student for example uh, i would like okay write my name again or we can uh, write about rage Okay, I choose the pink ones like this. Okay, after that we can click select 
for select the sticky note, we can drag uh, this sticky note all around our page. And also we can adjust the size, we can maximum or minimum like this. Uh, okay, if you uh, do not want the color for sticky note, don't worry, we can click uh, triple dots uh, in the top like this, we can duplicate. After that, we can click again and edit. So we can click none. So it is will be clear. So it like we uh, we write about something in our gym. Okay. So another tools uh, we can explore again is add image. So for information uh, in our gym, we cannot add some video, we just can add image. So for add image, uh, actually it's easily, uh, we can drag an image here, we can select file from our device, or maybe we can click Google image search, so we can type what you search in the box. And then you can um, click Google Drive, so we can add image that you want. Okay, here uh, I wanna, type uh, in the Google insert image search. For example, I would like to show you about my subject, what I teach uh, in last semester. Uh, I teach about a spectra NMR for eternal compound. So I would like to show right here. After that, I will choose one like this. So when I prepare about my Jamboard, actually I can record my uh, my explanation or I also uh, deliver to my student life so we can integrate it between Jam and Google Meet. So here, uh, subject that what I want to explain to my students so I will give them some instruction for example I can edit this instruction so I will ask my student uh, please uh, sorry please uh, identify functional group from functional group from that spectra okay I can get okay we drag here Okay, we can delete this one. Okay, yeah. after that, uh, I will, I will uh, present about this my jam to all of my students. I can record this or if we are live meeting, so I can share this jam by my presentation. So for example, I asked to my student, uh, can you identify functional group from this uh, spectra? Maybe I can share this gem for my other student. But before I share this gem to another student, uh, I will uh, show you about the last tool. This is a laser. Okay, laser is uh, similar with pointer. So if you usually use a pointer like this, Okay, we can point about uh, what the important thing to our presentation like this. Okay, we can select again. Okay. Now. And then if you want to share about your gem to other people, it's a very easy. You can click share. After that, uh, you can add um, other people or other teacher if you are in team teaching, maybe you can uh, add other teacher for your gem. You can select, uh, you want C can view or edit. So this is, I choose C can edit this gem. And I also give a message, please add another, another spectra. Okay, so we just click send. So this gem will, Send to Aulian Nurul. So another way we can copy this link. So everyone with this link actually can. Uh, they only just uh, can view this gem, or we can uh, change the uh, this one. So they with the link can edit uh, what gem that we have created before. Okay, like this. Uh, well, uh, before I close my presentation, uh, before you ask me to, uh, I would like to you watch this video. Maybe you.
Moon uh, to ask me how about we access Jamboard in our mobile device. So I have um, make uh, some video. So this video, I access my Jamboard from my, my mobile phone. So make sure you have the note first. Okay, I will watch this. Actually, for first time you open your chamber from your mobile device, is nothing different between you access chamber from the web. But in the next, you will know how uh, or what the difference between mobile device and via the web. Okay, it is same. We have to click one a little fast icon on the right button. After that, this is. Um, by device when I try my chamber. Okay, this is same when you click this one. Okay, I will stop this video. Okay, when you saw or you see when I do tutorial from the web, you uh, you cannot uh, find this assistive drawing tools from uh, Jamboard when we access from the web. But if we access Jamboard uh, from our mobile device, we can uh, find this is a benefit for and useful tool. This is assistive drawing tools. So we can see why this tool is very useful and helpful. Okay, this is, I just, uh, try to draw with the highlighter because I love uh, use highlighter. Okay, this is uh, I want to use the assistive drawing tools. So, like this. For example, if you want to create or draw about a shape, maybe what we draw is not perfect. Maybe a curly. Maybe it's not. Uh, good, but with the assistive draw, uh, drawing tools, it can be perfect. So you can look here. Okay. And another thing, uh, when you click text, okay, you can see, right, if in the web, we try to write a uh, text for example i write a uh, a alphabet maybe it's a curly and not perfect maybe uh it, it's difficult for me to draw a but with the assistive right with the assistive drawing tools it can be made more perfect a like this okay i will try another alphabet okay i try to draw b right Okay, and the last is C. So when you draw C, uh, even though it's not a perfect, but with the assistive drawing, so it's make perfect easily and directly. Okay. Uh, so I think that's all a difference between if you access Jamboard from your mobile device or you can access Jamboard from your uh, via the web, I mean, I'm so sorry. Okay, I think that's all, and thank you very much, and I hope you can enjoy your day. Okay, Mr. Mohammed, I will send the time to you. Yes, thank you very much for your clarifications and your explanation, uh, that, uh, a good session uh, indeed. Uh, I enjoyed that very, very much. Uh, so um, uh, we are going to... Um, uh, have questions from our attendees. If you uh, have any questions, just uh, feel free to write uh, them on the chat box or raise your hand and I can unmute you to speak if you would like. Okay, I will try to read questions yes, from going to chat, check box. The, the chat box. Okay. How can I share other my gem? Uh, actually, uh, you can easily share your gem. Uh, for example, you can share uh, to your Google Classroom. Okay, I will share my screen. I will um, show to you how we can share our gem to our Google Classroom. 
Okay. Right. Okay. Maybe uh, you also use a uh, Google Classroom for your LMS. Uh, this one. Okay. After you have uh, create your gem, why this? My screen. Okay. We can go back. After we create our gem, we can go back again uh, to home page uh, our gem board like this. Okay, wait a minute. Okay, uh, this is there are many gem that I have created before, uh, but don't worry because all of gem is uh, safe um, in our Google Drive. So when I click my Google Classroom, so I can uh, click class work, so I can create, for example, I will ask uh, to my student uh, uh, to finish about this homework. I can uh, click question or assessment, for example, assessment. So I can click app uh, and also we click Google Drive. So in the Google Drive, you can find that what we have create before. Okay, this is the gem that we get together. So I can click here and add this ones. After that, uh, we can give a title, for example, um, HNML Aspectra. I can give instruction uh, optional for my student. For example, please do uh, this homework. But uh, make sure they do not change or edit your original gem. Okay, so please about uh, do not edit or change an original gem. So, if you ask me uh, about how a student. Uh, to do not edit our gem, it's so simple. We can go back to our gem again. I will show you uh, why this is not. Okay. We can click our gem again. So if our student, uh, they have our gem, so they can click this. Uh, this icon, it means create frame. Create frame, it means we can add another page. So in another page, our student can um, do or finish their homework in the another page. So they can uh, give uh, some or add some sticky note. For example, my student name is uh, Dwi Rahmatun. Dwi Rahma. So they can add the sticky note. It's mean this is the pages homework of Dwi Rahma. Okay, I think that's all. Thanks a lot uh, for your great explanation. Uh, uh, I think uh, there is another uh, question about uh, can we use this uh, board for a live session or is there another whiteboard that we can use them on uh, a live show for my, uh, for my students or others? Live show? Yes. Live show, yes. A live show. Whiteboard for live show. Okay. Yes. If you want a live show of uh, your whiteboard, uh, actually, you can uh, collaborate uh, between your Jamboard and also your Google Meet. After that, you can present your Jamboard to your uh, student. After that, you can sell directly to our student. And then when they uh, can access this Jamboard, you please uh, your uh, our student to presenting uh, the Jamboard so they can explain what we ask to them. Yeah. Uh, can I like add, uh, can I add yes? Oh yes, I wanted to show me an example. Yes. Yes, we can use Zoom or we can use a uh, Google Meet. Yes, great. Okay. Uh, feel free, our attendees, to post uh, your own questions into the chat box. 
Okay, you can use Jamboard in real time along with some collaborator. Yes, we can use Jamboard in real time along with some collaborator. For example, if you uh, want uh, access my jam actually you can add your email on the chat box maybe i can send my jam to you so you can um, access my jam or you can edit my jam or maybe you you want to uh, create another uh, jam in my jam that i said to you like this okay. Okay, I have. Okay. Is there a person? Yeah. Okay. I think in the check check box is a nothing question again. Yes. Okay. A... Thanks. Okay. Thanks a lot, Miss uh, Nubia. Uh, thanks okay. a lot for our attendees. Yes. Uh, don't forget our next session uh, will be with Mr. Uh, Abdul Hakim. Uh, about a time on board the basic band, the name of Scology, two more they have come. And the lecture will be in Arabic. Uh, don't miss uh, us, and we will take a break for uh, 10 uh, minutes uh, for a last. And we are going back again at, um, inshallah, maximum uh, 3.40. Uh, keep uh, safe and wait for us. And you can log in again with the same link and uh, ID and password. Please okay. Please Thank you very much, Muhammad and all. Thank you all. Thank you for all. Thanks. We are waiting. And I wait for 10 minutes and we are going back again. Thanks. Bye. Thank you.